Okay, I want to share a little bit here what I've learned with this box creator. Here we create a box. And notice it's off to the right. Well, this was an obvious mistake. If we zoom out here, you can see the whole thing. My datum was set to the right side. The datum needs to be on the lower left. And now, if we go to Box Creator, make sure that you uh, set your tool. I use the eighth inch end mill here for this example and we create the box but notice it's laid out very poorly so we need to rotate these and delete these tool paths if you move those without deleting tool paths the tool paths stay in the same original place so I'll rotate these around this takes too long to do Slide this one down. I'm sure there's a better way to do this. Okay, as you can see, it's a much better layout, more efficient. So now we need to add our toolpaths back in that we deleted. So we'll switch over here to toolpaths. And if we zoom in, you can see there's two lines here created by the uh, box gadget. We're going to select the inside line here. And we're going to do the uh, d dovetail detect. And I just leave the settings all the same. And it creates these little lines. We'll do this for the other two pieces. You'll see what these lines are for in a second. We get to the toolpath creator. Okay. Now we'll go up here and we'll select toolpath creator and make sure this is set to 30, the angle is set to 30 degrees. That's what you need for the box creator. It defaults to 60 when you first open it. Do that, and you see it makes our toolpath. Now we're going to switch here to the profile toolpath. Let's set our Z for the depth of our board. Make sure that we have the correct bit. We'll use an eighth inch end mill. I find that works best. And we select the outside. It creates that second line. This time we're going to select the outside and we're going to make sure that we cut on the line, by the way, in our profile toolpath. Select those three, calculate, okay, now we will delete that background and there's our finished product. I hope this saves you some time and frustration while figuring out the box gadget. Don't forget the 30 degrees, very important.